Hi everybody, it's Danielle from Haverford Township Free Library and welcome to this week's Fantastical Fridays. If this is your first time tuning in, Fantastical Fridays is a weekly craft program focusing on fairies. We're building a fairy garden and each week we're making a new craft to add to our fairy garden so that by the end of the summer you have your own indoor fantastical fairy garden. The first week we made houses, last week we made flowers, and this week we are making dragonflies. How cute is that? Little dragonflies to fly around your fairy garden. This is a really simple craft, so I think you should be able to follow along with no problem. All right, so first we have a regular clothespin that we are going to decorate however we want. We have two pipe cleaners, some markers or however else, whatever you want to use to color your dragonfly. You can use crayons, you can use paints. I'm using markers. Some glue and some glitter. Glitter is optional, parents. Glitter is optional. So really simply, we are going to just color Okay, we're going to just color this. I'm going to make some stripes, some really quick stripes in purple and pink. You can make stripes, you can make polka dots, you can make it a solid color. So I have one set of pink stripes and I'm going to alternate it with purple, purple stripes. Purpley stripes. It's coming out a little darker than I thought, but maybe as it dries, it'll lighten up to a more purple color. All right, purple and pink dragonfly body. I, choose, I chose two different color pipe cleaners to match with my stripes, so I chose purple and pink, but you can choose the same color or you can use totally different colors if you want to. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your pipe cleaner and you're gonna make it into an, a circle and you're just gonna twist the ends together so you have a circle there. Then you're gonna make it into like a figure eight and twist that once or twice around there. Okay, one set of wings, one set of wings. Let's do the same thing with the second one. Twist the ends together in your circle. Okay, now make it a figure eight. Twist that together. Second set of wings. Now we're going to put it in our clothespin dragonfly. Just open it up there, one. Dragonfly. Now I'm going to make mine a little sparklier because this is for a fairy garden after all. So I have some glue. I am going to make a couple of Glue stripes going down there. And like I said, parents, this is optional. I got some glitter. I have some purple glitter. If I can get the top off, which it appears I can't do. So maybe, ah, there we go. I was going to say maybe that was a sign to not use any glitter. 
Okay, sprinkling my glitter on. <laughs> go. As you notice, I have some paper on the table to catch the glitter there. Look at that. Look at how sparkly. Look at how sparkly. So now we're going to put it in our fairy garden. Okay, so I've added our dragonflies to our fairy garden. So let's take a look around here. This was the house and the flower from last week. This was my daughter's house and flower from last week. She drew a castle to add to the fairy garden. And there are the dragonflies flying around. This is shaping up to look really nice. I can't wait to add some more each week to this fairy garden. By the end, it is going to be fantastic. I hope you enjoyed this week's Fantastical Friday. I can't wait to see your fairy gardens. Please take some photos for me and put them in the comments. I'd love to see what you're doing. And I hope you will join me next week when we add another fantastical craft to our garden. Bye for now.